lot of times people feel feelings inside of them themselves inside and 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 the fear starts to to eat them from inside and they don't know what to do this is why i'm talking to you about that thing again and again and again the fear is an enemy it gives you cold legs not to be able be able to function at all and it kills you you're not allowed to be afraid you need to fight with courage not to be afraid to fight to say i don't care i don't care like i've been saying in torah 155 that you will not gonna care at all about no confusion and no distractions and and no failures nothing you won't care nothing about what happens with your avodat Hashem, with the way that you serve Hashem. Just you're going to do what that you have to do, what that you're able to do. He's not afraid of nothing. And he doesn't look on no cancelling and no confusions in his work. Just he do what that he's able to do. That's it. Do what that you're able to do and be happy with that. Say thank you Hashem Bach today. I prayed here in the Amuna Center alone with no minyan. Thank you, God. Thank you. I cannot ask nothing more than that. Thank you. It's amazing. I remember myself 5 and 10 and 20 and 30 years ago. I wasn't here. I wasn't visiting the Amuna Center at all. It wasn't in my options at all. I was so far. Thank you for helping me, giving me a hand to cross that distance. At least now I'm doing things. I'm getting closer to the purpose. I'm doing another small thing in my Avodat Hashem. Is it small for you? Because you cannot understand how precious it is to do one small thing to get closer to Hashem. And another small thing, those are the good points that Rabban is talking about them. Good points. Not good bags, good suitcases, good wagons. No. Good points. That you said the name of Hashem in Bach, in Bracha. That you were able to say, Even if it took you one hour and a half after you woke up. So what? That one hour and a half erased that? A sin doesn't erase a mitzvah. It doesn't erase a mitzvah. A good deed that you've done cannot be erased. The Zohar Kadosh is saying, Even a good will Will, you wanted to keep mitzvah. You haven't kept that mitzvah. In the end, you were not putting tefillin in that day. You wanted to keep that Shabbos. In the end, you were violating that Shabbos. You were breaking that Shabbos to pieces. You drove on a bike to the sea. Stone. <laughs> <coughs> but you wanted to keep that Shabbos. It's just a temporary world that in this world, in this period of time, we have a mission. What's the mission? The mission is only not to forget the Creator, to remember that it's all Him, never to fall in the trap of all of those coverings, of all of those husks. husks.